What else are we going to find? What's in there? I think we're gonna find out, Jeff. Oh gosh, I love this stuff. <laughs> First I seen this, this is awesome. What's this other piece of furniture? Oh, it's the side piece. So I don't know if you notice <laughs> headboards behind you. Stuff in the dresser. Is there? Oh yes. I can barely see it, but it looks like it's some cool stuff. How are we doing today? Rapper's Table Auctioneer Extraordinary here. I'm with just Jeff and I bought this unit for $470. Saw a few things in there that made me interested. So you just never know. Gotta take a risk, gotta take a gamble sometimes, but I see things and I say, ah, I should be able to make my money back and hopefully the stuff that I don't see is where I make the real money. So let's find out. And the best thing, you don't have to spend $470. It's free. Just hit the bell, subscribe, get all your notifications. You guys don't want to miss a thing and check out our website, www.secondsense.com. Oh. This one hasn't been open for a while. You see the dust? I see the dust. There's some dirt. And uh, it's not packed, it's not stacked, but there's definitely some boxes and stuff in here. And I saw some tools, so I figured, well, tools, I should be able to make some money back. And uh, first off, we got Delta. And Jeff will tell you Delta. Good name, right? Good brand, yep. Scroll saw. What do you think, 50 bucks? Probably. Or at least $50. That top looks a little bit rusty, but that's nothing. Clean it right up. K kitchen box right there. Got some little French onion soup bowls. Some glassware. Some plates. Oh. Hopefully it's not like my dream, it's broken. I think that's the household looks fun. Hot, look at this, this looks like almost like a fur coat. It looks old. You know, we just we discussed from the pictures, it looks like we saw hardly any female stuff in here. Yeah, and I will find a female. Right off the rip. Right off the rip, a female coat. So, but it could be his grandma's, his mother's. Who knows? And then we know we got construction stuff. So this is all tape for drywall. This sanding sponges for some drywall. And I saw this rigid battery charger, yeah. so I'm hoping we have some 18 volt tools in there. Oh, I didn't see this. Dragon puzzle? That could be a good sign. So they collect dragon stuff. Or maybe some who knows? Video games. Who knows? Look at this thing, Jeff. That's a bolt. Oh man. What the heck you put together with that? Bridges? The house we were working out yesterday, the guy had a big one just laying in his yard as a yard ornament. Well, I guess I got yard ornament. I know these can be money. Is it in there? Ooh, feels heavy. Feels heavy. What is that, an angle drill? Or is it a saw? I'll find out. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! Yeah. Jack ham or a ham what do they call hammer drill. This is that one that you put the uh, charge in, I think. You put these 22 shell casings in, yeah. 27 right here. And then you go, just gonna put it in the concrete. So, so it's not a hammer drill. No, uh, this ain't a drill. This is uh, powered by CO2 cartridges. You put these things in, like spikes and stuff. And That's gotta be money. Yeah, I'd say at least 100 bucks or more. So a DX400B, we can look it up and see what it's worth, but like I always say, if there's money in the front, hopefully there's money in the back. Let's keep going. Oh my gosh. So the chain itself is at least $20, maybe more. We got more chain. That stuff's not as much. This is thin chain and this one's not very long. The other one, the other one three boxes of chain. I didn't see that coming. What about you, Jeff? No, no. Hey, before you get in there and take your sunglasses off, I have a question uh -huh. for the people watching this. Yes. Your glasses. Do you look more like you're from Chips or do you look more like you're from Top Gun? I would say you people put in the comments, what do you think? Do I look like 
I'm driving a motorcycle on chips for my flying F-16 fighter Tomcat. You be the judge. I'm going with cop. Little heat gun here. I've come across some of those that are a lot more inexpensive than you think. Yep, this is a Milwaukee too. Yep. So that's a great brand. Cha-ching. So at least for another 20 bucks. So the money's definitely adding up. More tools. So this looks like all like kind of flooring tools, grout, laying concrete and mud. Tools always sell. And that's one reason I bought this unit. I'm not big into tools because I'm more of a moving kind of guy than a tool kind of guy. But I seen tools and Jeff said tools always sell. Tools are money. So I'm hoping I make all my money back the 470 on the tools. Everything else in here is gravy and I find some unbelievable treasures like this. Hey Yogi, what's all got that picnic basket, huh? It's an old picnic basket. Oh, look at this. A little Pepsi advertising. Too bad it's not in the gray shape. The Pizza Hut. It's got good patina. Yeah, it's got some patina for sure. So this looks like they were using my for a picnic, Jeff. What is in here? This is some wood balls. Feet for a couch. Stands for something. Toolbox there, toolbox there, and then uh, hopefully that trunk is loaded with something awesome. Let's get this stuff out of our way and find out what we got. I just saw these and I knew that we got one, two different pairs. This one is missing that one piece, but those are money right there. 20, 30 bucks all day. I'm sure that piece is here. Oh, it's heavy. That's a good sign. There. Look at that. Nice. Husky. That's organized. Yeah, I'm missing two little pieces there. I might have them in here somewhere. But man. Complete set. That's like a that. nice set. That's beautiful. It's like almost hard to sell that one, you know. That's a nice one to keep in the van or truck. Oh, because it's got all those tools. It's like, oh. My problem is after like two weeks, none of the tools are left. Is that Snap-on? Blue Point. Blue Point. Just like Snap-on. That's good. We got the uh, tile cover here. So you put the tile on there and then you snap it. And then we got this giant stand in here. You think it's going to be empty? Nope. <laughs> Not the way this Full is Full of going. tools. Let's see what we got. Nice. Oh, these are all files. Not cheap. Especially hammer with plastic ends. That's all right. That's some cord in there. Some hammers. Saw blades. Those are big blades. I wonder yeah. if the big saw is here. It might be. What do you think this toolbox is worth? As is with the stuff in it. I don't know. 75 bucks used. Rolling toolbox. You said 75 bucks. How about the Husky? 50? I'd say 50. I'd say there's at least 100 bucks between the two. All right. So hopefully I'll make my money back on this unit. We're working that way in this thing. Grinders do well. Let's get this. Hold on. we got to get to that. they got to look at that. It's some repurposed stuff there. Electric bench grinder? Yeah. That's Let's another That's another 40. Or Jeff makes go-karts out of them. <laughs> <laughs> I, know, I know a guy that had some of those grinding wheels. We're doing all this stuff. Walk the stick. Someone carved this one. Julie, another walking stick. And a cotton fork. We got wood, metal, big piece of glass, Jeff. Look at this walking stick. Hmm. Really? Watch out, Jeff! I gotta see what's in this big trunk, man. And then we gotta look at this big. Oh, look at that! What is that? Oh, it's another a tile, tile saw. Yeah. Unfortunately, not a great shape. What do you got in there? Tools and stuff. The question is, is there something in this thing? Oh, it's heavy. That don't mean anything. They're always heavy. On top of that, yikes, my toes. Uh-oh. Black trunk. Well, I'm trying to get a map in. 
Are you pretty much like determined to get this open? Oh. I know where some tools are. Where? <laughs> like all around you. I'm just debating. Do you take the trunk apart without damage in that? What's in it. there? Brings back memories, man. Memories. All right, we busted open the trunk. I thought it was empty. Let's see. <laughs> Pictures. 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 It's got a certain smell to it. Yeah, musty goodness. Some zebra. Nike shoebox now. Must have had stuff in it. You think this picture's worth a buck? No, just it has to be worth some dough. For sure. It says here, here, 1400 feet of the ocean, the mighty Mississippi begins to flow on the winding way to the Gulf of Mexico. Huh. Looks like they're having so much fun. Lines. So, a bunch of stuff in there. this. This is some That's crazy a barn beam. Is that like made to look like that, or is that really old barn? It looks like barn beam, right? I was gonna say these are definitely old. Look at see the pegs in there. Oh yeah. So this wood here is probably who knows how old. That those dark. That's how that was kind of chiseled, right? To yeah. make that. That's pretty cool. That's all hand hand honed, Jeff. So what is it? I think this is the bottom. I think it's a workbench. Bottom. So somewhere there's a top that goes out. What's that up in the corner over there? What about there? this thing? How much is this thing? Bag for a pickup? Yep. I have no idea. It's about 50 bucks, right? I would think. Look at that. Is that the table in the corner or is that a door? I don't know. We're going to find out. We'll work our way. I think that's eventually going to be the table. So this is metal for uh, aluminum. Tackle. I think I got a name for this lock. What's the name for it? Handyman Special. The Handyman Special. Loaded. So there's at least another 20, 30 bucks. It's good to see he took a day off every once in a while. 20, 30 bucks? Yep. Oh. I'm hoping this is going to be cool stuff. It looks like it's a Handyman emptiness. But we do have antique. Stool. So we got old stuff in here. Oh, what else are we gonna find? Oh, what is that? What is that? Look at these old bottles. That's pretty cool. You see USA, you know they're old. My guess is probably fifties, maybe sixties, but we got think? vodka, bourbon, gin, and scotch. What do you think? I have no idea. I didn't ever see anything like that. Yeah. The the bottles look older than the print. Uh, they might even print at the same time. It's possible. But I think they were made like that. That's cool. They were very big in the bar stuff in the 50s oh. and 60s. Do you think they displayed them like that? Uh, that's possible. That's, that's cool. Looking down here and see what I can find. I see some sunglasses here. I see Simpson cards. True or false, when you get hit in the face with squirting water when you're what when you ring Krusty's doorbell. True or false? I guess I'd say yes. True. Yeah, true. And it <laughs> is true. See? Good job, Jeff. I don't not know not everything. We got some more baskets in here. I keep finding baskets in here. This is workshop room. <laughs> Huh. Workshop, so that looks like artist stuff, crafty. He's doing some crafting. It's a crafty. That's an antique tool. This is actually to lift up your old metal, like us, uh, things on the grill or on your stove. Remote control helicopter. There's a remote. Old pieces of metal. Interesting stuff. Here. Interesting. A mouse. 
random cool stuff. So we got these benches. They're ca cash money all day. And this says man and woman statue. You want to guess what's in there? Let's say a turtle. A turtle. That's what I was looking for. There you go. Oh my gosh! Wow, wow, wow. The best part, signed, stamped. So that's automatically going to increase the value. It's not just some random piece. It might be metal. I don't have gloves on. I have gloves on. Is it metal? I think it's concrete. What is that? It sounds like metal. You think? I don't know, does it sound like hollow metal to you? I don't know. Well, it's cool. We'll find out. You know what I call that? 1977. What do you, you know call that? For me, personally? Yeah. Time forgotten. <laughs> time forgotten. A sculpture in my area would be the, me chasing my wife. <laughs> well, this is a sewing drawer. Workshop room. Paint. Lots of paint. More tools. That's what I was hoping for. That's kind of nice. It's like a little like a Dremel type. Yeah. Craftsman rotary tool with all kind of look at all the bits in there. Yeah. Parts. Probably another 30, 40 bucks. I'd say at least 25. Part. 25. I'm thinking the statue could be 100 bucks. The statue's cool. Saws off. No. What is it? What Hinge. is it? Mortising template kit. So this is to put hinges on a door. What kind of door? Like a, uh, a, a wood like door. A, like an outdoor door? No, like an inside door. Or outdoor door. Any kind of door. That's pretty neat. So I'm assuming that's probably worth some money. I'm assuming people still need stuff like that to put hinges on doors. Mm -hmm. Especially if you're doing a whole house. And then, Craftsman, half power, on the workstation. So, what are the workstations worth? 20 30 bucks a piece, I'd say. So, right there, you're almost, bucks you're almost the, popping a hundred there. Yeah, so oh man, the Coca Cola cooler. I see the Simpsons thing there. And who knows? There's lots of boxes, lots of boxes, Jeff. Cyclone seed sower. Where that, Jeff? It's oh, a yeah. spreader. Out there selling their seeds. <laughs> seeds everywhere. So we're going to put that down as tested? Yes. Works and tested. I'm like Johnny Appleseed. Good, thing, good, thing, good, thing, there's no, good thing there's no chalk. <laughs> the Jolly Ball. You ever play with the Jolly Ball? No. Is that a, for weights, or do you throw it and run from it? Is it like, <laughs> is it like dodgeball? Got a bunch of old here, Jeff. I like old stuff. You like those? I see those hanging all over in your shop. Yeah. So this is just loaded. Where's the tin man at? Are you Get away! Tin? Get away! Are you the cowardly lion? I'm in between. Magnet. I'm the who's the guy that who's the guy that is behind the sheets? What's that? Who's the guy in Iron City? Yeah, you wish, but what character is what Jeff do you mean most? I wish? What character is Jeff most like in the Wizard stay, of Oz? Stay away, stay away. <laughs> put, it, put it inside in the comments. So there's a bunch more of that tackle and stuff. Looks like just some artificial plants. Sometimes these could be sterling silver. This one looks like it's just silver plated. Maybe stuff. We're going to start to find the stuff like Jeff said. Yeah, I was thinking all guy stuff from the pictures. Oh, yeah, look at that. It says Chanel. Hopefully, we find some Chanel jewelry. So, we got to get some of the stuff out of our way and look at all those boxes behind there. Look at this giant box right here. But we're finding everything. We're going already on here. But everything from antiques, collectibles, coat. Ooh. Too bad. That is an old, old Bible, looks like. It's got a charter right there. It might have been saved from a fire. 
all kind of pictures in there. And they put some stuff in there. So what year is this Bible? So let me see. Nineteen oh six. Oh, Captain, you're right. Nineteen twenty. Nineteen twenty Bible. You guys got driftwood. Hundred years old. We got an old lantern, and then this, the shoehorn. Not a shoehorn. It's from look at that, 1890. So this is for a cobbler right here. They put different sizes on there, making their shoe. This person definitely has antiques, collectible stuff. Hey, knows? you know what that shoe reminded me of? What's or that, that cobbler shoe? There's a Five Guys Burger we passed on the way here. Ooh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Five guys. How about some or, or Red steak? Robins. How about some mm, incense? Tea. Yeah. It it's always good to find good smell and stuff, bad smell and stuff. And then we have this little old did bench I, there. It looks for like a vanity bench. Did I say Red Robins? They have Red oh, Robins too. Red Robin. Too. Red Robin. Ooh, what is that? What is that? Is that a weight or a yeah. cowbell? It's an antique weight, I guess. I thought it was a bell, I wasn't sure. But that's an old counterweight. How heavy? It's heavy. That's what I'm gonna do. No, my toe's broken. I don't want to be around it. Oh, don't worry about that. I just want you oh, to open I'm your worried. mouth. I'm worried. Trust me, I'm worried. Open your mouth, and you're gonna put this hook on the one end, and every every minute that you hold in your mouth, I'll give you five bucks. <laughs> so think about it. In an hour, how much money can you make? Five bucks for a minute Price. times 60? That's 300 bucks. 300 bucks. Yeah. I'm offering you right now. No, I'm not sticking a piece of metal in my mouth. <laughs> nice try. Fun when it first started. Yeah. Look at these. All right, we got a new challenge. It involves carrying these. There's some weights on the side. I got a challenge for you. Oh, man. I thought about this today. Oh. This one just came to me. All right, so so you're you know you're all you and everything. I mean, you're you. So how about we do a challenge? We each get a two hundred and fifty dollar budget. We each get to buy a locker, and we see who buys the better locker for under two hundred fifty dollars. But you have to pay for it because it's all going to be your stuff. But I think I can buy a better locker than you. I'm old, but you can't count me out, man. Oh, I think he's afraid of me. Look at him. We'll that shut you up. Like said, if you think we should do the challenge, put it in. That shut you up. If you guys think we should do the challenge, put it in there. Yeah, you're afraid of me. That's I'm not afraid. Is. I just uh, think you want to spend my 250 bucks. <laughs> it's all good. How about whoever has a better locker, the other person has to spend by both of the units. Oh, I can't afford that. Yeah. I don't have a Let's place to put all this stuff. Is, Jeffy. Just Jeffy. So let's look back here. We got tons of boxes on one thing I've seen. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Well, you sure shut me up when you had me paying money. Oh, see, that was easy. That's nice. That is nice. Good shape. Ryobi charger. We found a few chargers. Where are those tools? Yeah, we want to find that those rigid yeah. tools. That's a stand for a camera. Oh. oh, by the way, did you see I found three selfie sticks? Yes. I was gonna say you didn't put one in your van. No, I forgot. Jeff, just Jeff. The important thing is though, I found them. That's true. What's in the workshop room box? Well, every one of those had crafting type materials. Huh. And there you have it. Crafting stuff. Charcoal pencils, stamps, sponges. Dies and a button collection, Jeff. Holy buttons, but guess what? I see something worth some money. Oh, yeah, nice. That's the good brain. Airbrush. Oh. We have the hose. We have everything but the brush. So that's got to be in here somewhere. Oh, I see more boxes down there. It says beads and buttons. 
Uh-oh. Uh oh, look, he's getting excited. Just calm down, calm down. It's still gonna be there. It says beads and buttons, but there's definitely old jewelry down here that they were using. And there's beads. I'm I'm starting to get a whole new new respect for eccentric people. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm seeing. I'm liking this person's style. Oh, I thought you were talking about me. Eccentric. No, you, you, you're, you're I don't know how to define different you. a word. <laughs> <laughs> so these look like glass beads, and beads are can be very expensive. I mean, think about how much land was traded for beads. So is this the? What is this one? Is that the airbrush thing? Aston. That might be the new airbrush thing. What is it? I think it's an airbrush with different tips. How do you power it? Is it with this air? With air. Uh, there's a little. There's a. So there should be a little compressor somewhere. Is oh, that what that is? No, that's not. Compressor. That's huge. Yeah. And calligraphy. We got pencils down here. So not a bad little box. It's good box. Good box. So now the question: What's in all these other boxes? The back here. I just saw this thing. What the heck is it? Like number 12 grind wheel or something? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sounds brutal. This whole thing's just loaded with antiques. Look at this. They call that a cordless grinding wheel. I remember I went to the one house and they had all this stuff hanging on the wall and it looked so cool. Look at that. Good coal, pure ice, and good coal. Oh. Multi-purpose. You can use your coal blocks so, and your ice. So and this works on a pressure system. Only well, applies as much pressure as how heavy the object is. Another pair of old scissors. So we've got a good wall hanging collection right there. Yep. Bowls. What else is in there? What is this thing, Jeff? Oh, it's like a hook or something that went on. <laughs> that was actually close. It wasn't that close. Yeah, if I've never hurt you. You want to much. play that back in slow motion and watch how I dived out of the way to save my life. I never, I never hurt life. you that much. Yeah. West Virginia, Georgia, South Dakota plates. I've been to South Dakota. Georgia, I'm pretty sure I've been to. West Virginia, I know I drove through it. What's in South Dakota? The Mount Rushmore. What's in these drawers? That's even better question. Oh, I'm empty. Not Mount Rushmore. Not Mount Rushmore. Old watering can. So lots of things in here that add up. Five dollars here, ten dollars there, twenty dollars there, fifty dollars, hundred dollars. I'm pretty sure we made about all of our money back. What do you think, Jeff? Absolutely. Now we have all these boxes left. We have cabinets and whatever's underneath the sheet. Maybe that's where they put the safe. We're gonna find out. Let's look in this box though. Odd shaped glass base. Looks like household stuff. Is this one? These are the kind of people that have cast iron pans that are really good. Aluminum whirlpool ice trays. So that's the thing, we have to go through all of the glass and everything because they could definitely have some cool antique vintage pieces in here. Or they could just have Irish Hutchin moonshine. Now legal. God bless America. About time, actually. We got all kinds of pans. Like I said, we have to look for cast iron. We could have some good pans. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. I don't know what that is, but I see all this old stuff down here. <laughs> That's what I'm liking. What was that thing? I have no clue. What is half of this stuff? Is that some type of mold or is it an ashtray or what? I think it's an ashtray. Homemade wind chime? Wow. I mean, this is the That's kind of stuff you never know what you're going to see, you never know what you're going to find in storage in it. That's why I love it out here. And I'll be back. Put a little note in here. Leave a note. It's all 
and this old metal and weird stuff. Look at these old nails. And books. So. Sears Robot Catalog, 1902 edition. Oh, the poor, poor, the pokey little puppy. I remember this book when I was a kid. Jeff liked it because I'm writing it himself. Let's see what that says. Double E. No desserts ever unless puppy never dig holes under this fence again. Yeah. <laughs> He's not digging holes. You see it says double E. So that's the edition it was. So you could do the math. It's a many, many, many editions after the first edition. What's in Mike's box? Hope it's not Mike. Oh. Time changer. Some Mike's business cards in there. Like Mike's books and paperwork. I'm hoping for some Mike's maybe comic books. That'd be nice. Yeah. From the kitchen of Michael. Mike's gold. I was hoping. Remember, I told you I want to start finding some gold coins and bars? Yeah. Help me out, bro. Alright, we're making our way back here. There's so much stuff back here. Who knows what else we're going to find? Like more chain? Hey, my grandfather used to say, man can never have enough chain. Yeah? Or change, I can't remember. It was one of them. One of the two. Yeah. <laughs> How about uh, Buckeye? Buckeye shells. Oh. We have a Buckeye tree. They're, they're really brutal. Yeah, I have uh, black walnut trees. Brutal, too. It says fabric dye, but that looks like rocks. Stones. Huh. What's inside these cabinets? I want to see what's underneath that sheet. Okay. Let's see More rocks. Sidewall chalk. Cranes. Oh, oh, oh! You got some toys? That's what I'm talking about. So we got some uh, micro machines. This looks like a Hot Wheel. Ice cream truck? No, Jeff, it has no ice cream in it for me. Muscles. That's a good sign. We might find some toys. A little sun kiss bottle. Hey, did I mention there was a Five Guys in a Red Robins? There's? Red Robins has endless fries. Well, why don't you load this stuff up? I'll go get lunch for myself <laughs> real quick. And I'll be back. Bring me back a fry? Oh, you want something? Oh, never mind. What is this thing? Oh, for a bandsaw? Yeah. Old school. Table saw. Table saw? Sorry. Table saw. Cups and cups. Oh, is it perfume or oil? Could be water. But it's brass. So you know it's old. And Sharon Williams. Old, old can. One time I found the really old can, I gave it to my one buddy. He works for Sharon Williams. Oh, wow. Some cool stuff back there. Oh, I'm going up, Jeff. Looks like sewing stuff. Here's that senior sewing machine we found earlier. Senior oil. We got Eagle Claw fishing stuff. God. Business cards. I could have used some of that the other night at my reunion. That would have been nice. The singer oil. Ooh. That's a little rusty. <laughs> I don't think it's going to help your singer. Is that, a, is that a bird feeder? Yes, look That's at that. pretty cool. Right? That's what I'm saying. There's some cool stuff back here. Oh, and it's on a stand. It's on a stand, ready to go. Ready to go. Just add Ooh. seeds. There's a bunch of nice stuff wrapped up on there. And look at the saw blade, Jeff. Oh, that's neat. This I don't know if I want to go back there with you. My little door? Yeah. Dude. That'd make a good door prize. I've seen a lot of saw blades. This might be the coolest one I've ever seen. Might be the longest one. Look at that, how decorative that is. So oh yeah, that. wait, whoa, whoa, let's, Over top let's, of your garage. Let's look at that. That is cool. Man. Whoa, you're gonna drop it on your toe. That's cool. Is that cool? That would go on my back porch. That would fit the motif I'm looking for. Is that the coolest one you've ever seen? 
It is. When's that going to be up for auction? I don't think you can afford it. Well, you oh. might get this one. Oh, I could afford it. You might get this one. It's cool too. It looks like mountains and Batman. It's okay. I want them both. You want I'm, them both? Yeah, I'm going for both. Oh my gosh. Put them as one lot. Don't make me bid twice. You've been working for free. Sure feels like it. Another cabinet, Jeff? Empty. I'm coming. Empty? Yeah, nothing to see. This says knickknack. Anyway, give Jeff's dog a bone. Oh, that bird feeder, I think I could put a new roof on that. Is that thing awesome? Oh, yeah, you it is. It. Never, ever we now around. are getting uh, hummingbirds. And you and, and I. trips over. You're yeah. going to take half this unit home. I know, I like this. I like the old stuff. Oh, look at them here. I like my stuff like I like my women. Nice and old. How about a set of dominoes? Come on, man. That was good stuff. You didn't even react to that. That was alright. I was just so ex excited about the yeah. card shuffle there that I don't have. Alright, I'm not going to lie to you. My my mother is starting to communicate with the senior citizens home. Yeah. And they all play dominoes, and she asked me to find her a set. i got to buy those. Oh, my gosh. Man, I'm shopping today. It's for my mom, Robert. It's shopping. Backgammon. Yeah, a little backgammon. Mini backgammon. Deluxe marbles. Marbles. Man, all the thing Jeff wants is in this. In the yeah. jewelry can, making. Can you hold the camera so I can dig for a minute? Alright, so I'm taking these. I got some of these. And, oh, look at that big dice. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You know who collects dice, don't you? No, who? Huh? Who? Look at this one! Oh man, come on, it's huge! Let me have it. Man, marbles, dice, this is all I, dominoes. This is all I need. From this box. <laughs> well, so I like, I, that's too small for me. I love playing back here. Huh. Alright, so let's put these in a special spot. All right, and then you go back to doing what you're doing. Special spot, huh? Yeah, some kind of... It says workshop room. Right, I'm back. Hey, you back. You can blame it all on Jeff. Hey, thanks, Rob. You're welcome. Hundred bucks. There's not many. There's not many people I feel comfortable alone with in the quarter of a storage locker in the middle. Of Just you and your wife? Yeah, definitely, hey, definitely not you. I'm feeling very uncomfortable here. Uh oh. What the heck is that? What's in there? We're gonna find out, Jeff. Gosh, I love this stuff. <laughs> First, I seen this. This is awesome. It is. That's old. That's World War II. Bugs Bunny with the bomb. We gotta pull this. Down. That's hand sewn. This right? might be the box we were looking for. It's a good box. Don't knock that one over. Oh yeah. What the heck is this? I see this right here. Uh, silver plate. I was hoping for some sterling silver. Did that cut some? No. I thought it had something to do with that scale weight. Is it a press or something? I don't know. Oh. It's old. Yeah. No clue what that is. And this bug going is too cool. Yeah. Tools. The box itself is pretty neat. Yeah, it's a cool little box. Huh. Interesting. Scissors. That's such a weird, weird box. There's the rest of the silver plate down here. There's a bunch of silver plate. One of these sterling would be alright. Green glass. It's definitely covered up back here. Some furniture. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, it's a couple pieces. This is a waterfall dresser. It has a curve on the top. That's why they call it a waterfall dresser. Very ornate handles. Probably 40s, 50s. See if there's anything in there. What's this piece though? Oh, no way. It's a really ornate shelf. 
people always like buying shelves, displaying stuff. And that's a good display shelf. It's a nice display piece. So I would say probably about 50 bucks or so. It's missing one of the claw feet. I actually have additional feet. I can probably put a new one on, or maybe two new ones. What's this other piece of furniture? Oh, it's the side piece. So I don't know if you notice <laughs> headboards behind you. Stuff in the dresser. Is there? Oh, yes. You can barely see it, but it looks like it's some cool stuff. We'll get in there one second. When you get a site like that, it's either jewelry or toys. Household kitchen lock. All kind of books. John, John Kennedy Jr. Library. We could have some nice old books in here. The Splendid Quest. 1929. Where's Jester? Alright. Top door or bottom? Well, top one you can open right away. <laughs> this is what I saw. Got me excited. That's old neat. Gabriel clock. So they got an old clock in there. Lebanon, Tennessee was made. Who knows what else they got? Oh, hunting and trapping license. 1952. Wow. And these are actually worth money. People collect these. There's all kind of stuff. Oh, look at this picture. There's my great great grandfather. There's Jeff's great great grandfather here. Yeah, I like his beard. Yeah, that's kind of your beard. Looks like we're going to have a bunch of old pictures probably down here. Oh, uh, that's St. Michael. Taking out Lucifer. Look, at they got knives on each other. Oh, they're holding their neck. That's Is that a knife? I think they got a knife. That's pretty wild. Wild for sure. So I love old photos, actually. Let's hope that was a pose and not an action photo. I hope so. All kind of interesting stuff in here. And, that, and that's drawer number one. <laughs> oh, yeah. And whatever's back there is hidden. Spy camera? It's a little camera. Pictures. More pictures. And I've seen this. And then I see these two powder things. Let's see what they got in the powder things. And those are beautiful. This one's empty. Oh, rock. It's a neat top, though. Those are beautiful. So here's a little camera. What's the difference between beautiful and pretty? Crystal. Well, people tell you you're pretty. And they tell me I'm beautiful. <laughs> so that should sound out real easy for me. <laughs> well, that's the difference between your mother and my mother. Oh, yeah, okay. I don't know, Joe. What the heck is this? Crystal arts work? Wow, that's that's actually pretty neat. Yeah, that's pretty neat. That took some time. So, what a neat little dresser drawer. So, who knows what else? Got so much more to go through. If you haven't checked out all of our other videos, check them out. Subscribe, like, hit the bell. You never know what you see. You never know what you're gonna find. Appreciate y'all watching. Let's see what's in this dresser next episode.